NASCAR has suspended driver Cody Ware indefinitely after he was booked into jail on assault charges today. Thank you for joining us tonight at 10. I'm Brian Blakely. Queen City News Northeast Bureau Chief Cindy Heiberger is following this story for us tonight. And Cindy, how serious are these charges? Yeah, Cody was charged with assault by strangulation, inflicting serious injury and also assault on a female. Now in the state of North Carolina, assault by strangulation that inflicts serious injury is a felony. So these are some serious charges. Four issues this time. It's Cody Ware in the 51. Look out on pit road. Cup Series driver Cody Ware's issues now happening off the track. The 27 year old is now indefinitely suspended from NASCAR after being charged with assault on a female and assault by strangulation. According to a police report, the incident happened at a home on Brawley School Road on April 3rd. That is the case. Um, you have to be held accountable. I think uh, all the leagues, NASCAR, NFL, they're all a little too lenient. Rick Ware Racing, Ware's Cup Series team, released a statement saying in part, we understand NASCAR's position on this matter and accept their decision. They went on to say the matter is still under investigation and Cody is fully cooperating with the authorities. Ware was released on a $3,000 bond just a few hours after being booked into jail. Prior to his arrest, Ware pulled out of the Food City dirt race in Bristol, Tennessee over the weekend to, quote, focus on a personal matter. But we did speak to an excited Cody Ware shortly after his 14th place finish at the Daytona 500 in February. I think that this is probably the most energetic 500 that I've been a part of, and this is my fourth one so far. So really honored just to be here racing with all the best and the best in the sport. This is not the first time the Ware family has been in the headlines for this kind of issue. In October 2021, Cody's brother Carson Ware was arrested for assaulting a female and injury to personal property. He was also suspended from NASCAR but reinstated in June 2022. Now, Rick Ware Racing is owned by Cody's father. The team says they're finalizing their plans for this weekend's race at Martinsville Speedway and they'll announce them in the coming days. Brian.